Well, according to that radar, here we are right here. I tip my finger. Hello, YouTube. Hello, YouTube. We got a lot of rain coming. A uh, lot of rain. Stretches all the way back to Des Moines and Ames area. Uh, basically, don't be surprised it goes back to, ooh, wow. It goes back to almost uh, Nebraska. We got it coming. <laughs> we got it coming. <laughs> it's a coming. Right in a line. <laughs> yep, no walking today. Yep, it is raining. Angie, if you're going to go anywhere, take an umbrella. Okay. Yeah, if you listen carefully, you don't hear. There's a, actually, there was a lawnmower running a few seconds ago. It just turned off, called it quits. Obviously, because it's raining. Yeah, look how the wet her uh, gotten. Yeah, what a bummer. I had plans to go out and do some errands. I could take the bus, but uh, we still got to walk in this weather. Okay, as of right now, it stopped raining. Hello, YouTube. All right. Yeah, it's been stopped raining for a while. We had some nice thunder boomers. Ooh, wow. Wish I had the camera going on to hear those. We had a, a lightning strike that was nearby. Yes, I do need a haircut. Bad. All right. Uh, we're going to cash in on our birthday chips. Uh, well, Angie got hers. I got mine. And that's all we're going to have because come home, we're going to be cooking some Meatloaf. I'm hungry, yes. I know you're hungry. We're I always just had hungry. a Lunchable. All right. All right, we had our snacks. We're going to head over. We don't have to bring you guys along today. So uh, we're going to head over off camera. And we'll be right back. Okay, we're home from Sobs. Hey, Angie, come over here. Hi, guys. Uh, we just met the winner of the beer for the year from Slops. And we know him. We know him for the ball games. Yep. And guess what? He doesn't drink. That's what I heard too. <laughs> uh, if I would have won it, I don't drink either. Well, that's right. If you guys would have won it, you probably won't drink either. Right. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, the winner, figure that out. The winner of the beer for the year from a local bar, Slops, don't even drink. Uh, his wife does, but uh, mm -hmm. not not the winner. Uh, but. Right. Uh, I heard there, was, heard there was some options. He collected on one option. Yes. Because it was equivalent of, I, if I did my math correctly, Ace in a flat, one of those beer flats that holds four six packs, 24 cans per flat. Uh, basically, it's 13 flats for the whole year. That's his beer supply. Yes. He claimed three already. Yeah. He's getting 10 next week. He's getting 10 next week. And he's going to be having a party. And so all that beer's going to be gone for the end of the year. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. In other yeah. words. Now listen. <coughs> if we would have had the Raider reunion now and if Chuck would have won it, all that beer would have been gone in two days. That's right. That is right, Angie. They would have been not just. I'm right on something. Yay! But. but if I want to stretch it out, I told you, Dad, is if it's not one family gathering, it will be in two family gatherings, that beer will be gone. Oh, you guys, if it would have been Christmas, when everybody was still alive, oh, boy. Oh, boy, yeah. Well, we didn't win, so that's the main thing. I mentioned that in last night's video. We did not, mm -hmm. I did not win. Did not win. Angie never entered. I had eight, I had nine entries in, actually. Yeah. I had about nine entries in, and I did not win, yep. so... But we met the winner. Right now... And he collects out of grass, just like I do. Yeah, that's cool. That's how he won. All right, right now Chuck is going to start supper. Yeah. Okay, very simple meatloaf recipe. This is so simple, it's foolproof. Uh, only fools will cook it this way. Okay, we got one pound of 80-20 uh, uh, hamburger, ground beef. That's hamburger. And a store brand of meatloaf seasoning. That's how we're going to cheat. Yeah, we're cheaters on this channel. Okay, we got one pound of hamburger. We got our seasoning in. 
in it right now or, or now we gotta do is we gotta mix it up let's mix it up right now okay we got our meatloaf made blended in and it's time to put it in the oven that's how I do it one pound to one package <laughs> that's a cheating way of doing meatloaf so now we gotta do the fixing I'm gonna cheat on the gravy oh by the way when I used to do the meatloaf recipes uh, years ago, I used to do uh, what do you call a clear duck sauce, uh, basically. It's a, a Chinese uh, sauce for your uh, duck meat and that. It used to be what they call a clear version of, well not really a clear version, but close to clear version of duck sauce. And I blend it with ketchup to make a glaze, and that glaze was awesome uh, basically I usually put it on the glaze while the meat was still raw uh, to let the, the, the seasonings and the sauce kind of soak in while it's cooking that made our meatloaf awesome but right now we have not seen the duck sauce that I like to get at the time I mean we got ketchup here I mean we use it for our French fries and potatoes and you know potato product, mostly French fries and tater tots, stuff like that. I'm not much of uh, ketchup on tater tots, but mostly French fries. Uh, we use them for our air hot air fryer. Oh yeah, I I just gotta go to the market for that kind of duck for that duck sauce again, so I can make that glaze uh, for our top of our meatloaf. That would made it awesome. And this is how we're going to cheat on our gravy store brand uh, brown gravy mix. Uh, one cup of water and one of these packages. Bring it to a boil as you stir it and it should make brown gravy. That's what we're going to use. Having fun, Angie? You know, uh, these recipes that we do, uh, that I do, I cheat. I know. I, I cheat. Yep. I cheat a lot. I know. But you at least. You make it from scratch. I cheat. I try to. I use packet stuff like this. I know. All You've right. had that for a while. Yeah. Angie, got good news. Dinner is served. Yeah. Yeah, meatloaf. With potatoes, gravy, peas, and carrots, and just gravy on the meat, the way you like it, right? Yes. I wish it was that secret sauce I made from years ago. Remember that? We used to live on 700 South. We haven't had that in a while. Yeah, I can't find the right duck sauce on it. Uh oh. As soon as I find out, I'll let you know, right? Yes. And of course, that is my plate right there. Looks yummy. Ooh, yeah, let's eat. Alright, dinner is wonderful. Angie's already in bed. And we're ready to wrap up this video. Uh, it started out uh, rainy, wet, a few thunderstorms, and not much happening. Oh, by the way, uh, reason it was a bit long clips uh, between today's video and why we made last night's video. I started playing uh, another PC game called uh, uh, City Skylines. I had this game for a while, and since we got this current computer, it will not play. Uh, then I found out if I would have removed all the uh, the mods I had built up on that game, it probably would log in better. Well, guess what? When I removed all those mods uh, on that game, the game is playing a lot better now. Uh, so I'm thinking about just focusing on the DLC packs. I just purchased uh, two of them that kind of play the game a little better. Am I going to share that game uh, with you guys here on YouTube? Probably not. Uh, because of being... It's a city building game and it's totally random. Not like Planet Coaster where basically I design the roller coasters and design how the park goes and everything else goes as is. I design all the roller coasters. Uh, except for that one ride, that one tower ride, I can adjust the height of it. But... Uh, but as the park layout, my design, uh, basically. And the coasters is my design. And any flat rides and water rides, uh, basically, it's my, my design. But except for most flat rides, which is basically, uh, I can design uh, how it operates, but uh, not the way it looks. 
or maybe just something like that. Yeah, we're just, I'm just enjoying a nice evening on the patio, taking a break from the uh, computer here. Oh, by the way, time you watch this video, Angie's birthday is coming around the corner. I'm hoping this video got up before then. Yeah, it's on October 5th is her Angie's birthday, uh, basically. And I'm going to try to surprise her something. It all depends on the budget I have. Because when I just downloaded a couple of DLC packs for the City of Skylines, I think I should still have enough funds, uh, basically, because... Uh, I'm getting something from Google. Uh, time you watch this video, I already received it. Uh, basically, it's that uh, I hit that threshold again for a small channel. It's always that threshold. It's always that threshold. Bigger channels, no problem. But this channel, I have to reach that certain threshold before we see something from Google and YouTube. Uh, basically, so we need to increase our views. Uh, basically, if we can. If not, uh, we'll probably do more live shows, uh, basically. Who knows? Uh, don't really like to do a whole lot of live shows. Especially with internet, the way it's acting again. Yes, our internet is acting up again. After a couple of weeks of doing wonderful, uh, as of today, it's... Yeah, that's what it's doing. I think I can, I think I can, and I won't, uh, basically. So, yeah, I guess it's... I guess that's why we are where we are when we upload, <laughs> basically. Alright, uh, gotta do more thoughts and we'll wrap up this video. Oh, by the way, on October 4th, uh, if you have not seen this by then, I'm thinking I have not talked to Angie. I'll have to let you guys know tomorrow for sure, but I'm thinking about going live, uh, basically. Uh, as our anniversary uh, video. So we probably won't have a regular upload. We'll just have it. But I have to decide till then. I have to talk to Angie about it. But it's the day before Angie's birthday. We will have a special live show. Uh, hopefully, either I do it with Angie or without Angie. I don't know. I have to talk to Angie uh, first, see what she thinks about it. All right. Uh, we're going to wrap up this video. We had a fairly decent day just doing a lot of stuff cheap way of cooking meatloaf, Chuck. Uh, why don't you just do a real meatloaf recipe for once? Well, at least one thing, I did use real meat. <laughs> like the public schools used for their meatloaf. That was horrendous back in those, back in the day. And that, so, uh, alright, uh, we're going to wrap this up. Uh, please like, share, subscribe, don't forget to hit subscribe on the notification bell. Oh, yeah, one last congratulations to the winner. We know him at the ballpark. Uh, I hope he has a nice party. And a lot of people say I should have won it. Uh, I don't really care. Uh, it's only bush light, uh, basically. So, uh, yeah, I could have shared it with you guys. Who knows? All right, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Sorry I didn't win uh, on that drawing, but it happens. I never win. Bye.